We have updated the assignment mark screen in Progress Book version 17.20 with a new look and improved performance, including autosave. Just click Try New Assignment Marks at the top right to access the updated screen. In the New Students drop-down list, at the top of the student column on the grid, you can choose to filter by student to see one student at a time, or by student group, with the student groups listed below the students on the list. When you hover over the student's name, the tooltip with the student information has an updated look as well. You can still enter a mark for each student, check missing, and check late. What's new about these fields is that in any of them, you can right-click and see a list of options including Fill Column and Clear Column. As you can see, neither of these options affects missing or late indicators. Every time you make a change on the new assignment mark screen, you will see the Auto Save message. If you are using the new assignment mark screen for a standards-based class, you have additional options in this right-click list in the Marks fields, Fill Row and Fill All Rows. Fill Row will duplicate the value in the current field to all the fields in that row. Clicking Fill Column and then Fill All Rows duplicates the values of the rows in the current column to the rows in all the other columns. These options save you time when you enter grades. The first assessment column displays in yellow. The totals in this column are the sums of the other columns. If you use Virtual Classroom and have tied a quiz to an assignment in Gradebook, you will also see the status of the quiz in the Status column and the Number of Attempts in the Number Tries column. You can now click any status link in the Status column to navigate to the Activity Grading screen in Virtual Classroom. The Assignment Mark screen provides a cleaner user interface, improved performance, and clearer functionality to make entering marks easier and faster.